Good morning. Good morning. We're on Fox 5 morning news right now. Uh, can we talk to one of you for a second? What, who are you all with? Hi. Hi. Hi, I'm, I'm James Canning. Nice to meet you. Oh, James, how are you? Good James, to see you. Uh, James actually works for uh, Nathan Fletcher in yes. the county. How's it going? Tell you me, know, tell me about your team. We had a great experience today. Um, we were out there interacting with a bunch of folks. Um, look, it's it's a difficult situation here at the county. We're really working to put more resources into the homelessness effort. Supervisor Fletcher is really focused this year on uh, vet ending veteran homelessness. Mm -hmm. you no, know, it's uh, we've seen a great decline in veteran homelessness, and we think this is an area where we can really help folks um, but as you saw across downtown there's a lot of people out there yeah. and so we, we're working we've put money into different cities to help them out uh, we have our mental health and behavioral health services out there uh, so we're really trying to help folks but yeah. it's, it's and we know we we, we uh, this happens every year this homeless count yes. very important homeless count happens every year and, uh, and uh, it, it really determines the homeless funding that comes into the county yes. um, and as you explained there have been a number of different uh, initiatives and measures that Absolutely. the county has done um, what kind of a response have you got or your team have gotten from the individuals, the unhoused individuals that are literally right now, so many of them, sleeping on the sidewalks. Yeah, um, you know, they, they seem to be appreciative of the fact that people care. Um, they, they are... Uh, hopeful that the, what we're able to do today with this count because it does bring more resources which allows us to help them in more ways uh, than they than they're being helped right now right um, and then there's folks that it, it was quite clear that we need to continue to push the services that we have the mental health the addiction treatment uh, frankly housing is going to end homelessness yeah. and so we really need to get that opportunity to get them into some housing and and there was folks out there who wanted help and we're, and we're going to help them James, thank you for sharing thank that. You. Is the supervi Supervisor Fletcher here? Is he uh, out he, and about? He, he was out and about a okay. little earlier, okay. uh, and now he is gone to take his kids to school. Didn't recognize you because of the beanie. Yes. <laughs> you have the beanie on. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, guys. So that is an idea of what is happening. Again, there are different volunteers who are stepping up on behalf of the county who are going out and tallying and surveying the individuals who are really considered to be the most critically homeless in our county. We'll have some more coverage coming your way in our next hour, but that is the very latest from downtown San Diego, guys. We'll send things back to you.